All right, day two. We are going over compatibility console one soft tube, the new Mac Studio Mac M1 Ultra Max, etc. etc. My name is Eddie Gray. Welcome to the channel. And we're looking at an instance of console. Everything's actually working really great. Uh, here I'll pull up console one. All right, you can see things are working, and I'll just go ahead and load a channel strip. Let's do the Chandler Zener Bender. All right. All right, let's go ahead and get this going. Okay, cool. So you, as you can see, everything is working great. It sounds awesome. Uh, I'm actually very stoked about this. I was afraid this was going to be very clunky. Now, there is something you should know. This is not going to work. It won't even appear in your plugin window, plugin manager. If you use plug search by speaker food, won't appear anywhere unless you do a couple of things. We know security and privacy is kind of tight these days in the Mac world. So you're always going to have to go in here and under the general tab, you're going to have to allow, uh, you're going to have to give clearance to unidentified developers. So that's the first thing. That's easy. Here's the second thing. Inside of your applications folder, you're going to want to look for the console one on screen display. Now I'm specifically talking about individuals that own the console one mixing system, either the fader one or the console one. Now, when you have this in focus, I want you to hit command I, and then I want you to enable open using Rosetta. This is the only way you can really get this going at this time at this venture the date today is april 21st so if something changes do give me the heads up but everything is working as it should i'm getting full translation everything is working the way that it needs to uh, let's go ahead and check out the gate here All right, my good friends, so SoftTube is up and running. I will tell you that if you don't enable Rosetta, you will get some of the SoftTube plugins, but everything is not gonna show up. You can tell that they're currently in transition, and in order to stay up to date with your plugins, you're gonna have to download, of course, SoftTube Central, which is the downloading system or hub that SoftTube uses uh, to get their whole thing organized. So, hey, thank you so much for watching the video. Uh, I'm going to keep going with this journey. I have a feeling that there are some people out there that are thinking about changing or thinking about going to the dark side, but they want to make sure that everything is ready, stabilized. And so hopefully that this, this video encourages you to do just that. Of course, your experience is going to be uniquely your own, but at this time, I'm just giving you the heads up that this is definitely working. It's definitely stable. Um, in fact, let's just bring up one more instance of it here. Uh, another instance of console one. All right. So that's popping up on channel strip number two and i'll just load this with let's say a eq and let's do the american class a so as you can see things are definitely on the up and up all right team if you have any questions for me please let me know uh videos to come i'm going to go over even tide make sure that everything is working in that department and a whole bunch of other great stuff go ahead and give the video a like go ahead and subscribe and of course i'll catch you on the next one eddie gray signing off see you later